Hey, today we're going to let ChatGPT choose my body paint. I'm going to be body painting Emma, and we're going to just let ChatGPT do its thing. A lot of people get very nervous about AI, and like a lot of artists have been really talking about it, like stealing their jobs. And I'm curious, can we use it as a tool for designing wow. an art piece? And I just want to see what it spits out at us. I think it's going to be really funny. Are you excited? I'm excited. I can't wait to see what it comes up with. Do you think it's a good idea that we're trying this? Or how, what are your feelings about AI right now? The idea of using it in this way is intriguing to me. Uh, I think it will be entertaining. I'm on the fence about it overall, but interested to try it and to see what creative kind of ideas it's able to come up with. Yeah, because I feel like, you know, when at least I'm trying to write a blog or use it for like create an Instagram caption or something like that, like you really have to like milk it a little bit or give it prompts um, to try to like get it to really give you like what you want, like to really get what you want out of it, I guess. Um, and for this one, I just want to like see what it spits out at us. So we're going to try like how many attempts should we let give it? Three or five? Three. three attempts. Okay, so we're going to give it three attempts. We're just going to do one that says like create a body painting that Trina Mary would do. And then we could do a create a painting either in this city, like for this area, or we could say with these colors. Which one do you think would be better? Like take these five colors and design a body painting. Mm, yeah, let's try that. That one? Okay. So that's what we're going to do. It's <laughs> going to be really cool. So we're going to do chat GPT designs a body painting. Chat GPT ch designs a body painting for Trina and Mary and Chat GPT designs a body painting with XYZ colors. So we're going to give it a try and see what happens. And then we're just going to paint whatever they tell us. And I think it's going to be hilarious. <laughs> <I'm excited. laughs> I don't know how to like record my screen. So you just, all you guys just have to see my like millions of tabs that are open. Um, okay. So design a body painting. Oh, maybe we should say design a body painting that can be done in two hours. Yeah. Can be done in two hours because we have a time restraint. Okay, let's see what it says. For this one, we're going to say um, design a body painting that Trina Mary can make in two, three hours two hours. Enchanted jungle. <laughs> okay. For some reason, they think I need enchanted jungle. All right, let's see. Okay, this one's a little vulnerable because I asked it to actually design one for me because there's enough information on the internet about me and my work, you know, over the last 17 years or I guess the last 15 years is what ChatGPT would have known about my artwork. So it says, Trina Mary is a talented body painter known for her intricate and detailed work. To create a body painting that she can plate within two hours, we need to simplify the design while still allowing her artistic flair to shine through. Let's go for a striking and visually impactful design. Theme, Enchanted Jungle. Ooh, what do you think about that theme? Sounds fun. Could be, could be. <laughs> Materials needed. Body paint colors, green, brown, gold, and black. And you have green, you have gold and black. So we could do that one. Body painting brushes and sponges, glitter and metallic body paint optional, water and paper towels for cleaning brushes and correcting mistakes. Design concept. The body painting will transform the model into a mysterious jungle creature, blending seamlessly with the surroundings of Rockaway Beach. <laughs> <laughs> It will feature elements like leaves, vines, and a touch of gold or metallic accents to give it an enchanting and magical look. So I guess I paint you and then we like put you in the bushes. <laughs> Things were in the jungle. Somewhere. <laughs> in somewhere that looks like the jungle. Um, step by step execution. Base coat. Start with a green base coat. Uh, leaves and vines using various shades of green and brown. I'm going to kind of breeze through this one. Using various shades of green and brown, create leafy patterns and vine-like structures across the model's body. These can be done by using a medium-sized brush and blending the colors together. Gold metallic accents. Add a touch of gold or metallic body paint to some of the leaves and vines. This will give the design an 
an enchanted and magical feel because it's gold. <laughs> details, add some details like tiny flowers or insect using black body paint. These intricate details will like tiny black flowers. Um, these intricate details will add depth and interest to the design. That just sounds like it's interesting that you painted dead flowers. <laughs> Why are the flowers black? It is interesting. Um, highlights, use a lighter shade of green or white to add highlights on the edges of the vines and leaves. So we'll give the body painting a more three-dimensional look. Final touches, step back and assess the overall design. All right, all right, so let's try one more. Okay, so if you had to choose right now, which one would you choose? Celestial galaxy or enchanted jungle? I think I'd go with the galaxy. It's galaxy, okay. What do you think of these names? I think it's great that they title their ideas. Yeah, they're brilliant. That's definitely something that I don't do. I don't go, oh, mm -hmm. I'm gonna title. Like that titling work is actually extremely painful for me. And I really hate titling. In the very beginning is interesting. Before yeah. you even have a finished product or like a real yeah. painting. Yeah, that feels really mm -hmm. amateur but I'm gonna go for it because let's see what AI makes us paint. Okay, let's do one more, which is, what was it? Here's the colors. This is this is all the body paint that I have that is unused as of right now that Emma, well, I think mostly unused, <laughs> that Emma could choose from. So I'm gonna let her close her eyes and just pick from oh. here and see what we get. We need two more colors because she's got Black, gold, and white from Castle Cosmetics. Okay, so Emma's gonna choose. So we right now we have gold, black, and white slash gray <laughs> from from like a different painting. Um, so we just need two more colors. So go ahead. Emma. Okay, close my eyes and pick. Yeah, close your eyes. Really dig in there. There's one. There's two. What'd you get? Like a teal. Robin egg. Okay. And a pert violet. Okay. It feels like Galaxy is waiting to happen. Mm -hmm. Let's find out what ChatGPT says. Okay, so now we're gonna take it up a notch and say design a body painting <laughs> with light blue, purple, you know, violet, black, white, and gold. Yeah? Okay. Is he doing it? Oh, oh it's so fast. Seriously, this is so weird. Well, I think it might be celestial again. Galactic dreams. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's one Very track mine. The universe. Okay, so step by step execution according to ChatGPT. Number one, base coat. Start by applying a dark base coat using a black body paint. Cover the entire body with an even layer using a large sponge or brush. This will provide a dark backdrop for the galaxy design. Again, this is not the way that I would approach this. I think it's gonna to be too dark for the rest of the body. I would approach this by adding the blues and the purples actually first and the blacks on the outside and then blend it in so you really get that color pop of like the purple and blues. But we're doing what ChatGPT said, right? Because everybody's worried that ChatGPT or AI is gonna steal their jobs. So I guess we're just gonna have a whole lot of black mess. Here we go, I'm gonna show you. <laughs> Maybe I'm wrong too, because I'm actually using a new body paint. It might hold up differently. So we're gonna find out. So I got my big brush by Castle Cosmetics, which is already stained green. I'm so sorry for that. And I got a black paint also by Castle Cosmetics donated. So we're gonna go get painty and try out this new paint and see if you can layer it like that. We'll see, ChatGPT. <laughs> Step two is nebulae and galaxies using the navy blue and purple body paint to create swirling patterns resembling nebulae and galaxies. So this can be done using a medium sized brush and blending the colors together. Be creative and spread them across the chest, arms, backs, and legs. And I'm gonna add them to the face because we're not gonna just leave her face black, guys. 
Next, it tells me to take a tiny brush and make little stars, but actually, instead, I'm going to use a toothbrush and flick the stars on her. final piece it's um not the best lighting in here i'm gonna try to take it her to a place where there's better lighting we follow chat gpt i'm really happy that like the blue showed up over this black this is castle cosmetics and so it actually did show up which is phenomenal okay folks so she's all done this is what it looks like like i wasn't sure i wasn't convinced that actually the purple and the blue were gonna layer but we used a new body paint brand called castle cosmetics and so she hi emma hi. <laughs> we got another body paint model in the house i wanted to see the awesome this is emma anna emma oh my god what do you think you're so right. That paint really just layered right on top. I know. I'm really surprised because usually black makes it muddy, but the Castle Cosmetics did a really good job. You want to nice. give a 360? Nice. Turn and show her the whole thing. Oh, yes. Looks really good. And honestly, like, so very impressed. good details. We got some metallics in there. We, like, followed instructions and added some more of the, like, white highlights around the nebula. I did this all with the toothbrush and then I added a couple little white dots as well as gold dots. Just make the twinkle lights. But overall looking really good, honestly. Crazy thing is that we told ChatGPT that we needed a design we could do in two hours. How long did it take you? Under one. 45 <laughs> minutes. 45 minutes. So ChatGPT sorely underestimated how, uh, how long it was gonna take me. But mm -hmm. that's all right. ChatGPT didn't know it was going to be me painting until <laughs> I was, I was So to be fair. There's Speedy. But she, there she is in all her celestial, what was it again? Celestial. I don't remember the title ChatGPT came out with. Galaxy. Celestial I'm very galaxy, jealous. Maybe. <laughs> so this is in all her celestialness. <laughs> all her galaxiness. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,